the reason I got my name, I was originally the Cherokee goat soap. But everybody kept saying, you're so crazy bringing those goats in your van and dressing them up in outfits. You're just, you're so crazy. And I said, yes, I am. I said, I'm going to be the crazy goat lady. And it just stuck. So never did I think I'd be a beach girl and then a country girl. But I came here and I saw an ad for a caretaker for a little ranch in Sycamore Canyon. The lady had goats and she said, oh, honey, this is not for you. I've never seen a goat sip in a zoo. But I went over there, I milked it faster than her, and she was doing it 40 years. She says, you're hired. I got more and more goats, and I had to find a way to pay for them. <laughs> so I started researching and finding recipes. The goat milk soap that I make is a goat milk and hemp. Um, it has a great lather. It doesn't dry your skin out. doesn't leave a soap scum. Men love to use it to shave with. It's just a real nourishing soap because of the goat's milk. And again, the goat's milk, because the goat's milk has all those vitamins and proteins and lipids and minerals, that's what makes goat milk better than your bar of soap that you buy at the grocery store. Um, I also make a lotion that has calendula. And calendula is dry from the, the marigold family, so it's good for eczema, psoriasis, dry skin, itchy skin. And I have three doctors now that are carrying that in their office. The mama who just, she's already had her, this is her second time at kidding, she gave me triplets, so I had two girls and a boy. I like to have them <laughs> right before farmer's markets begin so that I can bring them to the markets. Luckily, the small ones, they stay small for relatively a good six months so that I can keep bringing them um, to the market and just seeing the joy, the kids' faces, oh my goodness, when they come. I, I do a little, like a little petting zoo at the farmer's market and um, so the kids come up there and, and they can go in and play with them or hold them. Goats love it. Goats love to be played with. They love the attention. Um, the more the better. I have some people that they, I, I look and they've walked away with my goat and the goat's just sitting there like this on their, on their head with their head on their shoulder. So yeah, they love it and they love kids. When I take them to the market, uh, people that never had goats or want goats, um, questions. You can have a little a backyard and as long as you have a place to keep them the little ones don't grow up so big you know they're only about this big mm -hmm. so you can have them make some dogs are bigger than the goats mm -hmm. so you can have a couple goats in your backyard that's the next for the crazy goat lady more recipes <laughs> and more goats <laughs> yeah